Hi, my name is Jeff McBride and I'm the Vice President of Winemaking at Benziger Family Winery. Today I want to spend a little time talking to you about the five components that you get in a wine from your palate and why they're so important to us and what we focus on as a winemaker. The five components that you can taste, this is not smell, but what you actually taste are sweet, sour, bitter, umami, and salty. And each one of those stand for a component in the wine that you taste. Sweetness is any residual sugar that may be in the wine. The normal palate can't taste below 0.3 grams per milliliter. Sour is acid. It's the citric acid, it's the tart tartaric acids that you get in a wine. Bitter is the tannin, that material, especially in a red wine, sometimes in a white wine, that dries your palate out. Big tannins will be on the side of your mouth, and very sharp tannins will be right on the tip of your tongue. Umami is the aspect of savory or texture. It's what gives you depth. It's the 3D dimension of wine itself. And salty, last but not least, is a measurement of pH. The higher a pH in a wine, the more salty or flabby a wine will taste. These are all components that exist naturally in the wine grapes themselves. It can also be manipulated if they happen to be deficient in the balance of these components in the winemaking process. Here at Benziger Family Winery, we depend on how we grow our grapes sustainably, organically, and biodynamically to give us enough of these natural grape components that we don't have to do manipulation in the cellar. That's part of how we over-deliver beyond the varietal character. I hope that is some information that's helpful for you for enjoyment of wine, and thank you for supporting Benziger Family Wine.